Hi guys, and welcome back to anti Meta Dimensions. So remember that last time we beat all the challenges, but this is big. Because now I can afford this last upgrade. Which means now I can start buying this. And now I'm going to get more infinity points, so I'm just going to hold M here. And, well, look how fast of an infinity I can get. This is crazy. I am going to focus on upgrading my auto buyers. Especially, um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going to, um, get two levels of each of these. Now I have 600, so I can get another two level of these, and now I'm on bulk purchase, as you can see. Now I can get bulk buy on some of these dimensions. So I'm actually going to set this to zero. It's just the speed of our auto buyers that's um, sort of stopping us. Because if I hold M, it's fast. So I'm going to save up for this next upgrade, so um, I'll see you then. Okay guys, as you can see, we have a thousand infinity points now. So I can get this. And I, um, so this is how you want to set your auto bars. You just want to upgrade them as much as possible. So, now this is a two times bulk buy. I'll just try to get all of them to two times bulk buy. So, um, it's just basically doing this. I've almost got the fifth dimension auto buyer to its max interval, so yeah, it always maxes at zero point one seconds. Um and we're getting eight infinity points on each crunch now, which helps. Um and our infinity time is down to about zero point seven five eight seconds. Which is a about as slow as we really need to get it. It's possible to get it to about five seconds before getting the last upgrade. Um, okay, two times bulk buy, which is pretty good. Um, let's do the seventh auto buyer. We need 128, so it's not too bad. I mean, if we get 8 infinity points in 0 0.75 seconds, that's like 640 infinity points per minute. I just calculated that. Our infinity points are going up fast. Um, so I can get these two auto buyer upgrades. I'll just get this one. This auto buyer is maxed already. It's pretty good. Now let's get this one. The eighth dimension is auto buyers almost maxed. I really need to upgrade the tick speed one. Let's let's do that now. Luckily, on the tick speed one, we don't need to upgrade bulk buy. It just buys max. So the bulk buy is only active when you have buys until ten. Okay, here's the tick speed auto buyer. Fully upgraded. Now I, um, so once I get 128 infinity points, I should be able to get the eight dimension one to two times bulk buy. Yeah, good. Now it might be quite expensive to upgrade the eighth one, so I'll just see you when I get the 8th dimension auto buyer to 2 times bulk buy. Okay, I'm back, and by doing that I got an achievement 
Um, it's this one. I didn't know if it would cost 256 or if I would have to upgrade it again, so... Yeah, we're definitely getting a lot of these achievements. This will be possible once we break infinity and we can get more ticks. This one? Well, you'll see when it's possible. So just a reminder, to break infinity you need to get the big crunch interval, automated big crunch interval, to 0 0.1. So we're working on it. Um, so, now I'm going to work on upgrading these top ones. I'm going to get this one, and now we've maxed our dimension boost one. So, we really don't need to upgrade our galaxy one, it's just the big crunch one. And the bulk buy. But apart from that, there's nothing we can really do. I'll try getting all of them to four times bulk buy. Which might help. I'll just hold M for now. Because it's not cheating. Um, I don't really have any way to like have something on the M button to hold it down for me. And now, yeah, we just really need to focus on these auto buyers. It's kind of a weird part of the game, but I mean, it doesn't matter. So, I'm going to get these last two to four times bulk buy. And I might get the earlier ones up. Um,. Just, uh, okay, we need a hundred, no, we need 256. It's annoying that we have, like, one less than a multiple of eight. It's, it's just, it's just bad. Here we go, eighth dimension, auto buyer. Now we've got everything to four times bulk buy. But we really need some of these earlier ones, like... Try and get this one to 16 times. Well, I mean, that automated infinity is not even fast. Look at this to, six, to 16 times. I'll just get them. I'll try to get them in order of price. It's just floating point error, anyway. Um, now my infinity points is actually a multiple of eight, which is really satisfying. And see how fast this is. So it actually, doesn't do any dimension booster galaxies. What if I set this to eleven? It does one dimension boost, but I think it slows it down a little bit. Automatic sacrifice might help, but I really don't need it. What if I set this to 11 and then try sacrificing? Oh, it really doesn't matter what we do at this point. I'll just try and get this one up to 8 times bulk buy. And now, as promised, I'll focus on upgrading these last two auto buyers up here. And, um. And yeah. I'm not holding M right now. The big crunch one, okay. Now it big crunches every three seconds. So that's like, it's like okay. I might get the big crunch one again, I'm not sure. Another infinity point doubler might help, I'm not sure. So I'm just gonna manually click it every other. Okay, you know what, I'll just hold M. 
So I'll just do three crunches and then I'll auto one crunch. Seems like the winning strategy. So I'll go. I'll, I'll upgrade the galaxy one. Now it's down to like once 1.5 seconds. Even though I don't really need that. Once we max out the Beaker Crunch one, we'll be good to go. I'll get all of these until they cost about 600, so... Um... So I'm just trying to get a lot of Infinity Points. It's it's a little bit slow, but... it's just a one, There's just a 1-2 to two hour wall before we bring in Infinity. Now, here's... Okay, I'm just I said all of them till they cost about six hundred, like this one. So I need three hundred eight. Kinda funny, but um Yeah, we're halfway there. Um we're up to two hundred. I'm just Maybe I'll just spam because it's it's just a little bit annoying when I like miss the big crunch button by like a millisecond. Okay, here we go. Eight times bulk buy. Now the fifth dimension is falling behind on its bulk buy. Need a hundred fifty four infinity points. And there we go. Now now most of the stuff is on eight times bulk buy except for our eighth dimension. Now we need 370 to upgrade this. Um. And. Yeah, that's pretty good. I'll work on upgrading these really cheap ones, like the third dimension one. Um and so now we have sixteen, 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 eight, 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 four. That's see how fast an automated run is. It's getting a little bit better. Let's let's actually look. All of them seem to be buying it until Costs E three oh eight. So it doesn't look like the bulk buy is the problem, it just looks like it's the slower update rate. I might try one thing, I don't know if this is gonna work, but I might try setting my update rate to a hundred milliseconds and just seeing how fast it is automated. Then how fast it is when I'm holding M, because when I'm holding M it can't really get any faster, but when I'm holding M like this it's like it can like update faster. Um, that's that's what's happening. So I'll get a few more auto buyers. So here's what I'll do. Um, I really don't need to upgrade them, so I think I'll just end the episode here because there's nothing more for me to really do. So. Bye. I'll just get this because now it can crunch automatically. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.